It's beer o'clock on Reload Craft Beer. Today we're going to beer from Brasserie Sisterine and it's a bottle of their Piax Dua Triple coming in at 10% ABV. Swing bottle top. Brasserie Collier. They're based in Belgium, of course. Belgium craft beer. Let's get this beer out into a glass and see what we get. Look at the smoke on the bottle opening. Beer in the glass then. I'm looking forward to this one. It's got a two finger white head. Look at the suspension in the glass. Good levels of carbonation. It's a hazy amber coloured ale. Let's get the aroma. Yeah, lemon. A dryness, candied Belgian sugar. And some biscuit malt, it smells really good. Let's dive in, cheers everybody. And Believe it or not, we're in the middle of a storm. They called it the fourth UK storm of the year. I don't know what the name of the storm is, but it's blowing a gale out there. It's cold, it's January. What are you supposed to do? It's dark, it's cold, it's wet. This is perfect. This is the perfect beer to warm the cockles of your heart. It's lovely, there's a touch of alcohol that just runs through your throat and into the pit of your stomach. It warms you from the inside. It is lemony. There's, there's lots of Belgian candied sugar coming through in the flavour. There's some spice. There's a level of dryness from the beer, but that 10% ABV is, is really what... It's made the beer. Nice mouthfeel. But still drink a bit, still a drinkable beer, good carbonation, fantastic. The beer is available from beersofeurope.co.uk, the largest online beer shop in the UK with a fantastic range of beer from all around the world. Belgium, Germany, France, Spain, Sweden, America. Check it out in the description box of this video, beersofeurope.co.uk. Smells good. tastes wonderful absolutely wonderful it's a real delight of a beer look at that carbonation chasing the head of the glass doesn't that look great an old brewer once told me the smaller the bubble the better the beer and well, of course the carbonation or the bubble if you like doesn't look or doesn't get much smaller than that so Belgian candy sugar, there's some lemon, uh, good carbonation, pushes the beer around the inside of the mouth, releases more of that flavour. It's got a very drinkable mouthfeel, but at the same time, it's it's ten percent. So it's got it's, it's got a chocolate of malt in here to get it to ten percent. Maybe a touch of coriander spice coming through on the back end. With a lemon. It's a solid brew, it really is a solid brew. What well, more than solid, it's a Stone the Crows beer. I've not had a beer from this brewery, uh, Brasserie Collier. I'm, I'll have a look on my channel, I might have done. Paxdoerbeer.be 
33 centilitre bottle. Because I'm in 2019, so it's well, I had this beer at the back end of 2017, so it lasts for years. A 10% Belgian beer, you could probably open it in 50 years time. If you wanted, if you wanted to, and it'd be fine. Nothing wrong with it. So let's rate it. Pux or Pux du. Looks good. Smells good. Tastes fantastic. I like that enough to give it a 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Relo Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.